Hey everyone, I finally upgraded to Windows 8.1 Preview on my Surface RT. Um, the thing is I can't downgrade it anymore because um, they said you can't and I have to wait until the final release. So I'm stuck with the preview until the final release until they update me. So it's still stable. I like it a lot and it works well. Um, so now you can see all the features right here. This is the start uh, screen and it has a, you know slideshows and all that stuff does this little animations it looks like it's like coming in and out and all that stuff so anyways let's look at this new desktop it went straight to the desktop not the start screen see that bam um so the start menu button is right down here you also get the new outlook R rt um and the start menu you can actually adjust it now whether you want to go to the apps search or to the start menu itself. So I'm, I put it as a app search, so I'm going to click it. So I'm in the apps area now. So the difference what they did here was um, they categorized it now. So they got by name, by date installed, by most used, by category, and you know they even added new applications to the to the to the utility. So now you got the sound recorder, you got the scan, and you got the rating list, and the calculator, and the alarms. So those are the main features that should have been in Windows 8 a long time ago, and I don't know why. Uh, you could also see the background is now in the background, <laughs> instead of that other background that you had to, you know, the, the generic background. So now they also integrated that you can now slide it down and go back to the start screen slide it up slide it down slide it up so it makes it more simpler and easier to to scroll through um, for desktop users it'd be easy too because now you don't have to keep on clicking on the side search whatever no more of this and search all that stuff everything you can just swipe it up with a simple click of a mouse or finger and the new icons of course now you got the large and the small that's the new change and then you can adjust it or whatever so it's, it looks a lot better um, in order for you to change these icon sizes is you have to actually hold it down now and then you actually change it from on the bottom in different size from large wide to small and medium and the cool thing is now they added the groups you can rename different groups on the side you know and check it out all that stuff so I'm going to click it again, go back, double click it again, go back to no. So they made it more like a smartphone where you have to hold it down and then whatever. Um, instead of flicking it like what you what you usually do. Usually you would flick it down, but it confused a lot of people. So it's better now that you hold it and then. So that's the thing that you'd have to get used to. Um, what else? What else? Oh yeah, and they changed also the settings, the PC settings. Uh, it's all different now, so even SkyDrive plays a huge role in the new 8.1, so everything integrates integrates all in, in one area, so you get the picture password, you get the account, so everything is more organized, and then you can add folders to your slideshow and all that stuff. And then you got SkyDrive, where they changed it, and I can check how many, you can see files, and sync, all that stuff. All that jazz. Um, but yeah, that, that's pretty much what the major features in the Windows 8.1 preview, and I'm sure they're going to add in more. Um, the main part I like about this now for the RT, since we have no other alternative browsers, um, that Internet Explorer 8 uh, and that 8, 11 is now a lot faster, way faster than I expected. Um, it's very smooth too. So in, when you flick it up in the Windows 8 before, you would get the tabs on the top. Now it's on the bottom, so you can scroll left and right. Put as many tabs as you want. You can scroll left and right. And the cool feature about this now is that you can press, you can go to settings, and then you go to options, and then over here you see always show address bar and tabs. You click that, and you have it shown up here. See that? Perfect. All of that. So you can go to new tab. So you have the original type of uh, sort of Windows 7, Windows, you know, kind of tabs that you see. So it's perfect how they laid it out here. And that's pretty much it. So uh, hopefully, oops, smart class. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. And um, if, any, if anything else comes around, then I'll let you know. So thank you.